Good evening everybody, uh, picked up my Citroen Grand Picasso uh, 2015 a few days ago, it's the exclusive plus model fitted with the uh, 8 gig jukebox, unfortunately no CD player so if you can't figure the jukebox out uh, you're pretty much stuck for listening uh, unless you can stream from your phone or figure out how to connect to USB. Spent a few hours tonight trying to figure out how to upload music onto the jukebox. There's absolutely no forums open for it at the moment. Nobody seems to have a clue. There's loads of people deleting things and then having to refer back through to the Citroen dealership to uh, figure out how to do it. Thought I'd put a short video together having figured it out after a couple of hours or so fiddling around and uh, hopefully it'll help you rather than having to contact Citroen and uh, have them scratch their heads over it. So first of all is um, you can see I've got the jukebox screen up now got the ignition running just to stop it going into economy uh, mode during the video. Got so far four just normal um, sort of everyday listening albums on it which you can see there from scrolling through and they're all listed there with the relevant songs in the folders. So they're the ones that I've successfully managed to put up. So that's on the jukebox setting as you can see from the source input. I've currently got a, uh, a 2 gig USB drive into it, just a pen drive, nothing fancy, a few quid from uh, most shops. It's formatted to uh, FAT32 format and uh, just using WMA format music at the moment although you can use MP3 and uh, several others if you just check the handbook they'll tell you which ones you can use. So make sure that it's on, uh, it's on FAT32, make sure you, your memory stick's formatted uh, and empty of all folders and other rubbish that the car won't be able to read and that'll just cause it to have a bit of a hissy fit with. Put your music on, don't put it in subfolders, just make sure that your uh, your music is titled with the uh, the name of the album and the name of the artist if you want the name of the track and then just list them file by file straight onto the uh, USB drive otherwise again the jukebox throws a hissy fit and don't recognise the uh, the folder types and just says it can't read it. So first of all there we go on to the uh, USB through the media list. As you can see we're currently in the uh, the jukebox mode so it won't show you the the copy which would appear in this corner here. Okay. So we're going to source and USB. As you can see there, we've got the music playing from the USB. Now this song and the tracks and everything I've already got listed on the jukebox, it was one of those albums that you saw earlier. So to put a new album on, again USB in the source, media list, and then copy jukebox. BD30 is a, a folder name, means nothing to anybody. So if you just highlight album there, it'll uh, scroll you down all the albums that are saved on your USB. As I said, I've already done these bottom three here. So to put the top one on, which isn't on there already, just put a tick next to that. Alternatively, you can uh, select as many as you want or even select all and it'll select them all for you. Once you've selected the albums that you want to put on, click copy. You can either put it into a folder name which you've already created or one of the uh, the standard ones which come on the uh, the car. I've deleted all the standard ones because I don't find them particularly entertaining. And I've just created one called Casual Listening. You can either keep structure where you'll import the new music into the Casual Listening or you can create a new folder where you get the keyboard to rename the folder. And I know that this album 
is full of rock music. So we'll call it rock. There you go, and it'll copy it. it takes a couple of seconds per track, but a uh, typical album should be done in under a minute. No, uh, no real, real issues. And there we go, successfully completed. So again then, we're still on the USB format. So if we go back in and hit jukebox again, you'll be able to see now, there's not four, there's five albums. And that one there is the one that we've just uploaded. So that's how to upload your uh, your music onto Citroen C4 Grand Picasso with the uh, the jukebox function. I believe it'll also uh, be the same technology in most of the current Citroen vehicles, uh, especially on the exclusive models. A simple uh, USB plug in and play, and that's the sort of formats that you need to be looking at. So remember, key points that I found is uh, USB stick needs to be formatted FAT32. It will do WMA and uh, MP3 formats. Unfortunately, depending on the format and, and depending on what, how you've got it set up on your computer will depend whether you get the album artwork across. But everything else uh, is fairly plain sailing and easy to do. Just remember, don't put things into a, a subfolder on your USB stick. Just list them one file straight after the other, and in the uh, the file properties of each one, just ensure that the uh, the album name is filled in. The magic of computers will do the rest once it gets uploaded into the jukebox. Hope that's been uh, of use to at least some of you, if not all of you, and hopefully. You'll be able to not waste many, many hours of your precious few first few days of your new vehicle trying to figure out the jukebox setting. Enjoy your music. I'm going to go and relax now I've done it. <laughs>